I wrote a paper three or four years ago which was looking at some survey data and we just discovered just by happenstance that these uh, numbers were dropping in the mid-1980s and no one had actually reported this. Obviously, uh, we're living in an era of uh, you know, face-to-face -face where, where a candidate's uh, non-verbal uh, qualities has a very great impact on whether or not people are going to vote for him. The idea that people uh, like new faces. So Barack Obama in 2008, as an African-American and a completely unknown person, got a lot of favorable, he was breaking barriers. And I would guess that in 2016, we'll see exactly the same thing. Media tend to focus, accentuate the negative. There's a lot of uh, advertising that attacks uh, the candidate on the other side. The internet and the blogosphere has contributed very powerfully. A lot of uh, mean-spirited commentary out there. And so I would say political discourse has had a lot to do with it. Um, over the last 20 years, they've moved apart. You know, the Republicans are the conservative party. The Democrats are the Liberal Party, but it's also a question of uh, representations by the media, and the media tend to single out the most extreme instances, and so it gets amplified as a result.